Hey guys, I'm Matt, Matt Wedding Adventures. Thank you for clicking on the video. I got something a bit different for you today. Um, my dad just bought a button, which is perfect for the channel. And uh, we came to Lake James, which is in Marion, Morganton, North Carolina. It covers both counties. And um, we are at Canal Boat Landing. And last night we got to looking, trying to find a good ramp, boat ramp, a video that shows the boat ramp and how what it looks like, what we can expect. And we didn't find nothing. So maybe I can show y'all guys a little bit about the boat ramp, show you the lake, and maybe we'll do a little fishing. So you come in this way, right here. The road's running through this way. You come in this way. A lot of parking up here, which is nice. Also, if you're an early bird, well, we're not really early, but it's a Monday morning, so it's not too crowded. You can get one of these spots, which is really close to where you launch your boat. Uh, by the way, it does have bathrooms. Uh, canal boat ramp does have bathrooms, men and women's. And are they clean? They're cleaning up <laughs> for, a, for a boat ramp. But anyways, I'm locking up the truck. I'm going to walk down here where Dad is. He got the boat, so he launched it. Lock the doors. Let's go. And the canal boat ramp has three slips and one dock. So here you got one slip here. That's what we launched. You got this slip and this slip. The two on the right here. You got a boat, you know, you got a dock in between, which is nice. One on the left, you do not. Handicap parking there, the information over there, and here's the lake. Now that few buildings there in the center of the screen, that is actually a, a store that you can access from the lake. It's like a general store where you have anything you need for a boat, any tackle you need for fishing, live bait, and fuel. If you need to fuel up your boat, you can just stay on the lake. Just uh, pull back up to the landing. Golly, give me my hair, guys. <laughs> it's windy. But uh, we just pulled back up to the landing to uh, get the minter bucket, get some minters. But uh, the wind's picking up. It's probably about 60 degrees today. It was chilly this morning, but it's warmed up some, but it's still chilly. Mainly because it's so windy. We've been fishing probably now four hours. Hadn't caught a thing.
my hair. <laughs> Golly. Dad just uh, dropped me off at the boat ramp. I'm going to back the truck in. He's going to pull on and we're going to call it a day. We got here about 8. It's now 2 o'clock. Wow. Didn't catch a thing. Just being honest, I'm used to pond fishing, fishing in farm ponds and stuff. I never fished a lake much. And it's a different story than fishing a farm pond. But we'll learn it. We'll get there. Now that Dad got the boat, we might go a little more often. But first time I've been in lake fishing in probably, gosh, six years. But it's really something you got to learn. It's probably best to get somebody that does know and go with you or you go with them to teach you. But, uh, but this, this, this video probably ain't so much about fishing. It's about showing you this boat ramp, boat landing and tour around Lake James. But we're gonna get the boat loaded up and I'll show you how it looks on the way out. But this water got real choppy. I mean, it's got kind of overcast. And you can see that on that last clip, it got really rough. Almost too rough to do any fishing in your bigger pool. Now we, we got up in some of them. We, we got up in a uh, cove that does a fishing. It was fine in the cove because you have a wind blow. But if you these bigger pools, it's rough. That water is rough. Now this canal boat ramp, the landing, it's right next to Lake James State Park and Paddy's Creek Recreational Area, which we've camped a few times on Paddy's Creek area. And this is a public and there's no, there's no, I'm not seeing no times that you can and can't use it. But let me show what we see here. So this is the, the highway right here. Comes up through here. That's the sign. Canal Bridge Access is the name of it. That's what it looks like. There's your bathhouse down there. Entrance. But yeah, I don't see a time on the signs or anywhere that you can and can't use this access. There is a time on the bathrooms. Uh, different months is different times. Of course, your busier months stays up and probably later. And like right now, I think it says like maybe from seven to seven or something like that. Can't remember exactly sure, but it does close the, bath the bathroom too. <laughs> and you know, that's pretty important as well. But, but anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. And hope if you in the area and you want to come to this access, I hope it helps you out. If you don't mind, give a like and subscribe. See you on the next one, guys.